In this experiment, we will understand what sounds loudness and pitch are. The items required for this experiment are a styrofoam ball, glue, a piece of rigid stiff thread about 50 centimeters long. If your thread is not stiff, you can apply some glue on its length to make it stiff. You will also need an audio speaker. For the second setup, we will require a long and a short rubber band and a lid of a plastic box or a shoe box. With the help of the glue, attach the styrofoam ball to the end of the stiff thread. Suspend the styrofoam ball using the thread such that it is facing the audio speaker. Now, play music on your speaker. Observe how the styrofoam ball moves when the volume of the music changes. As an alternate to the audio speaker, you can do this experiment by striking a steel tumbler filled with water. In the next setup, stretch the short and the long rubber bands across the width of the lid. Pull and release the rubber bands and observe the vibrations in them and the quality of the sound produced. Amplitude is the fluctuation or displacement of a wave from its mean or average value. In the case of a sound wave, it is the extent to which air particles are displaced by the sound. Amplitude of sound is experienced by our ears as the loudness of that sound. Loudness depends on the magnitude of the vibrations of the object producing the sound. Larger the amplitude of the vibration, louder the sound. Smaller the amplitude, feebler the sound. In this experiment, when the volume of the music is high, the styrofoam ball moves more than when it does when the volume is low. Frequency is the speed of the vibration and this determines the pitch of the sound. If the vibrations producing the sound occur faster, the frequency of the vibrations is said to be higher. Frequency indicates how many vibrations happen in a standard amount of time like a second or minute. When the smaller and tightly strung rubber band is pulled and released, it vibrates faster. Its frequency is more and the sound generated is shriller. In other words, the pitch is higher. In the case of the long rubber band, the frequency of vibrations is less and hence the sound is less shrill. In other words, the pitch is lower.